Hospitals and clinics across the state and nation are having their own emergency, a massive shortage of Latino doctors. Now, a group of local physicians is sounding that alarm. NBC Barry's Damien Trujillo visited a San Jose clinic to dig in deeper into the problem and what the possible solutions might be. Health experts tell me this has been an ongoing issue for years. There's been a shortage of doctors in general, but Latinos are at the top of the list. Gardner Health Services has all the medical equipment it needs to provide sound, adequate diagnosis, but it's lacking a key component, enough Latino doctors to serve its largely Latino patients. It is a challenge. Raimundo Espinosa is CEO at Gardner. His Latino physician roster mirrors that of the state and the county. In California, only 6% of physicians are Latino, according to the latest research out of UCLA. In Santa Clara County, where a quarter of the population is Latino, only 4% of all doctors are Latino. Yet Latinos make up 51% of the county's hospital janitorial staff. Latino providers, Latino physicians, uh, they're the most difficult because everybody wants them because they can communicate, you know, they're bilingual, and they can relate. Why is that important? Cuando mis niños estaban chiquitos era difícil porque pues a señas nos entendíamos. Maria Elena says when her children were small, she had to use hand signals with doctors because neither spoke the other's language. So on September 27th, doctors in Santa Clara County and across the country are celebrating National Latino Physicians Day. It's an effort to knock down the barriers and convince more Latino students to enter the medical field. They realize the road to a meaningful solution is a long one. They basically said that it would take, uh, we would need 54,000 uh, more physicians to reach parity. <laughs> you laugh, but it's, it's, not, it's, not it's, it's a nervous laugh. Yeah. Espinosa says it'll be a daily struggle, trying to recruit Latino doctors from a small pool that everyone is trying to get into. But considering what's at stake, everyone understands the importance of overcoming that struggle. In the South Bay, Damian Trujillo, NBC Bay Area News.